Hi everyone, today we're talking about how you can conduct 30, 60 and 90 day reviews inside Microsoft Teams using TeamFlight. But before that, what are 30, 60 and 90 day reviews? Well, they're structured evaluations conducted at certain intervals during an employee's onboarding process. They are a key part of any onboarding program and they help you track an employee's progress, performance and integration into the job during their first months of employment. So what are some of the benefits of conducting 30, 60 and 90 day reviews? Well, they promote a culture of continuous feedback in your organization. You're checking in with your new hires and offering your feedback to them. They also create the perfect framework for goal setting. In the 30 day review, you set goals for the 60 day one. And in the 60 day one, you do the same for the 90 day one and create these development plans for your employees. They also are a great opportunity for you to recognize your employees for the stuff they do in between those reviews. And lastly, they help you identify high performers during the onboarding process so you can invest in their growth. Now let me show you how you can conduct these reviews inside Microsoft Teams with TeamFlex. So the first thing I have to do is go into TeamFlex Admin Center and here we are. So I'm going into Modules and then selecting Reviews and then selecting start new review cycles. As you can see, I have tons of awesome performance review templates that I can pick from. And I'm picking 30 day review with self review. Let's, all right, let's click start. And we're inside the template now. This is where we can customize everything. For example, we can toggle goal related questions on and off and go into review questions and pick out one of many pre-made question sets or customize them and write questions of our own. We can also toggle 360 degree feedback on and off. And if we go into the results section, we can edit the way we view our results. And we can even add a new criteria and change its weight. Right here's where we can customize the way we do development plans, attachments, signatures, so on and so forth. And now I'm going to pick an automation scenario and I'm going to pick my favorite. Automate for employees who complete their first X amount of days with the company. Since this is a 30 day review, let's make sure it's 30 days and everything else seems perfect, but you can toggle and customize everything about this review template. Let's click save automation and I'm done. Now I'm going to go inside my employees account and see what they see as they're filling out this review. All right, here we are inside Adele's account. She will be completing this review. And as you can see, I have a notification from TeamFlect and I can either click see review and go into the review itself or just go to the TeamFlect homepage, go into reviews and see my review and click complete self review. So first the person being reviewed has to fill out the self review section. And then Miriam, this person's manager, will be filling out their part of the evaluation. So let's start filling out these questions and I already have these answers saved up. So, and let's put in my part of the answers. And once I'm done, all I have to do is click submit. That's how easy it is for an employee to fill out a 30 day review inside TeamFlect. And let's go the other way now. I'm inside Adele's manager, Miriam's account. And as you can see, she just received a notification saying Adele completed her 30 day review. Let's click see review. And on the left, you can see Adele's self review. And now on the right, Adele's manager is going to be putting in her answers. And as I'm doing that, take a look at the right side. You can see Adele's goal progression, task completion rates, and all the recognition she received all readily available inside the review. And now let's put in our final results. Let's give her a four for cultural fit, and a five for the rest of it. And you can see Adele's review results right here. And now if I have any comments, public or private, I can put them in. And here's the most important part. Right here is where you can set development goals for your employees. I create. And if I'm done with the review, I can click release and finalize. And done. That's Adele's 30 day review. And finally, since we're in the manager's account already, let's click reviews about my team. This is where leaders can see all the reviews about their team. As you can see, Adele's review has just been finalized 
but Alex still hasn't completed his. So I can always send Alex a reminder. And if I want to see the reviews previously completed, I can just click see review and view them all. And that is how you can conduct 30, 60, and 90 day reviews inside Microsoft Teams using TeamFlight. And as you're doing that, don't forget to say hi to your new hires from us. We know they'll do great. Team Flect. Build teams that deliver.